Well, it wouldn't be right for us not to visit the Glen Sound uh, stand here at IBC. And of course, we had to do it. And we've got Mark Wilson with me. Hi, Mark. Hi, John. Good to see you again. And you, and you. Now, today, we're going to talk about Dante. So, I mean, I think, first of all, you should let us know a little bit about what Dante is and what you can do with it. Well, Dante um, is being spoke about a lot in the broadcast world at the moment. It's cropping up in many places. Uh, a network audio system offering us the ability to move many audio channels across uh, a network, um, making the whole process of, of, of networked audio very simple for us, particularly for commentary purposes. Um, the Dante modules we're using in our new system here are the 8x8, 18 uh, 8 output module which means we have uh, the Inferno, which is our commentary box, our front-end commentary box, making use of most of the I.O. available on the, the Dante module that we're using. So we have seven talkback circuits and seven inputs to the headphones, um, which can all be configured, obviously, via the Dante control software. Very simple, free software, uh, cross points, very simple to configure. If this is connected into a, a network, when you run the Dante software, it will be identified as a Dante product. There's the Inferno commentary box, and it be be configured whether you're plugging into a, a desk, a router, or any other Dante-enabled uh, product, uh, which means it's very, very powerful as a, a retro add-on to another system. Customers are looking maybe for a commentary solution. Yeah. Um, and they already have the infrastructure of a Dante network, um, this is a great cost-effective add-on for commentary. Not just as a single box, yep. but you add multiple boxes, um, multiple infernos, you have a two, three position commentary system. Um, so it makes it very flexible. We have both the Dante copper connections here for the uh, redundant network and the fiber connection. Um, we will take power from the switch if the switch uh, is offering PoE. Um, but if not, we have um, a local power supply here and just controls on the back for the input gain and whether it's mic line or, or phantom level. So our box is very straightforward, actually, but it has our compressor limiter front end uh, and it, it's a tough, powerful commentary box. Uh, to partner with that, we have our Dark 88, or GSI Dark 88 uh, is the full title. If you're not using a Dante router, you can still use our Dante-enabled systems because this is the um, breakout box end for our Dante network. What that means, it has the Dante 8-in, 8-out interface here, exactly the same as the back of the Inferno, but this is essentially then just a breakout box. So it means as part of the network, you have 8 XLR ins, 8 XLR outs. It's very straightforward. It's an extended breakout box. It's the IO snake to partner with our Inferno commentary box. Um, it's also, because it is a, a snake effectively, you could use two of these together and you have an 18 8 out across the Dante network. Very, very powerful. And together, again, you can use one box, you can use two Inferno, three Inferno, back to the breakouts of the Dark 88, and that's our Dante-enabled commentary system, which we think for the future, over the next few years, is going to be very significant for us. Great, that's fantastic, Mark. Now, this is the first time we've seen this. Um, when are people going to be able to start to order these? Well, we'd take orders now, to be honest. <laughs> but but we're, this will be shipping before the end of the year. So um, most of our work is done on the Inferno. We're just starting to look at the Dark 88 now, um, and this will be available for the end of the year to ship. Fantastic. Thank you, Mark. Now, if people want to find out more information about this system, and of course, your massive range of products here, uh, what's the website they can go to? Well, I'd love them to look at our shiny new website. Yeah. Uh, glensound.co.uk Mark, thank you very much. Uh, always good to go and uh, talk to Mark here at Glensound. Make sure you go and check out the website. We put the link on screen now. And don't forget to look up us on our YouTube channel, our website, for everything that we've been doing here at IBC 2014.